Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am going to be showing you my favorite glute and hamstring workout. I hope you enjoy this video and if you do, give it a thumbs up. Without further ado, let's get started. Prior to any lower body training sessions, I activate my glutes using this band to ensure my glutes are warmed up and firing adequately. This is an important step to lower body training days. This next exercise I am performing is the power squat. I do these to bump up my heart rate and warm up my legs before any compound movement. This is a great conditioning exercise as well. Now I am performing Smith Machine hip thrusters. When you perform these, make sure that you are squeezing at the top, lowering slowly, and exploding up. Please note that these clips are sped up. Next up, we have barbell pause squats. Pick a weight that you can do 10, 8, and 6 reps consecutively after 30 seconds rest in between each set. Make sure you are pausing at the bottom for 3 seconds. Do your best to get at parallel, if not below parallel, on these squats. Make sure you are squeezing your glutes all the way through the movement. Like one of my previous coaches told me, an ugly butt in the gym is a hot butt outside of the gym. Next up, we have kettlebell squats. Make sure you are squeezing your glutes all the way through the movement. Perform these reps slow and controlled. Next, I am performing back extensions. Make sure you are squeezing your glutes through the entire movement this exercise is not only great for your lower back, but also your glutes and hamstrings. I promise that after these four sets of 15, your back, glutes, and hamstrings will be on fire. Next up, I am performing one of my favorite lower body exercises. This exercise targets the hamstrings and the glutes especially. Make sure you are performing these reps slow and controlled. Please note that this clip is sped up. The last exercise of this workout are the Swiss ball leg curls. Make sure your butt stays off the ground. Perform these reps slow and controlled. I finished my workout with a 15 minute cool down incline walk. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. Once again, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope to see you in my next one.